Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the Box Stop. Thanks for coming out tonight. My name is Brian Kennard. I'm the director here at the Box Stop. Uh, thanks for joining us. Uh, how many of you are here for the first time? Any first timers in the house? Handful. Of you? <laughs> yeah. First -timers Woo! On the stage. Yeah. Awesome. That one, that's a person that is excited, excited about being here. Uh, awesome. Well, thank you so much for being here. Let me give you a brief history of the Box Stop and what we do. Uh, and then we'll get on to the music. Um, the original Bob Stock was privately owned. It was established in the early 90s, located on East 40th and St. Clair. And then in the mid 90s, it moved to a spot on West 6th. And in the early 2000s, this fine listening room establishment was built from the ground up specifically to be a jazz venue here in Cleveland. We're going to be a little jazzy tonight, but a uh, little bit of something different tonight for you. Um, but it was privately owned until about uh, uh, 2013, at which point, uh, the original owners decided to close it down and put it up for sale, but after a short time they decided instead of selling the bomb stop, they were going to donate the entire facility to the music settlement. <laughs> and we have some uh, music settlement representatives here tonight. Uh, we've got our CEO, Jerry Presti, here in the audience. Uh, uh, along with one of our board members, uh, Lynn Eckendorf. Uh, so thank you so much for being here. Thanks for supporting. Uh, and uh, all that we do at the Bob Stop. Uh, but for those of you who aren't familiar with uh, the Music Settlement, uh, the Music Settlement is a 112-year-old community music program right here in Cleveland. It's one of the oldest community music programs in the country with everything from early childhood programs, music lessons and ensembles, music therapy, a brand new creative aging department. So a little bit of something for everyone at the Music Settlement. You can check them out and learn more at themusicsettlement.org. Uh, and we are, of course, the fourth branch of the music settlement. One of the great things about being part of a nonprofit and having a bar is that we get to sell you some tasty drinks while you listen to your music, while you're supporting live music here in Cleveland. And so, uh, with every purchase at the bar, your uh, your uh, purchase goes into the operating budget of the music settlement. So you're not only helping support these musicians on stage tonight with every drink but you're also supporting education and music education in Cleveland. You're drinking for the kids, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> yes. So thank you so much for uh, supporting the children in the, most, uh, in the most fun way possible, right? So uh, we appreciate that very much. Um, and we're, uh, uh, I do have to just mention, we're not, uh, we don't have the kitchen open tonight, but we did just start a brand new kitchen partnership last month with Sky Lorays. Oh, right. uh, yeah, okay. yeah, all right. Uh, Sky Lorays, they're a uh, private chef and catering company here in town, uh, owned by Chef Eric Wells. Really fantastic food, great people, um, and uh, we really hope that you come out and join us on a Friday, Saturday, or Sunday in the near future when they're serving food, because uh, the food's excellent. Uh, we're so happy to have someone in our kitchen uh, making food again. Um, and hopefully in the near future we'll expand to other days during the week. Uh, but be on the lookout. Uh, and if you want to learn more and you want to keep on tabs about what we're doing, uh, both here uh, in the, with the kitchen and what we're doing show-wise, uh, we do have an email list at the door. You can sign up there uh, and you'll get an email a week from us and we'll let you know all the great shows that are coming up. Uh, but we also have our social media, Facebook and Instagram. You can follow us there. Uh, and uh, like everything that we do, uh, those likes count. We also have a brand new YouTube channel where we're live streaming tonight. We've been running that for the last several months. Um, and uh, we're just uh, closing in on 400 subscribers there, which is great for not pushing that too much and uh, just continuing to do what we do. So keep supporting us there. Go ahead and subscribe to our YouTube channel. And for those of you who are joining us via live stream, if you want to donate, uh, and directly support these musicians on stage. There's a donation live stream attendee option uh, on the ticketing page for this event. Uh, those, uh, those tickets, uh, or the link for that is in the description. And again, that directly supports the band. Um, so, awesome. 
We sell CDs too. <laughs> and uh, if you want to also support the band, if you were here in person, they did bring some CDs. So that's a that's a great way to put money directly into the artist's pockets. So uh, uh, as a, as a musician myself, we always appreciate it when you want to buy our music, uh, not just listen to it on uh, Spotify or something. So uh, support these musicians in any way. Uh, that you uh, so choose. Um, and uh, tonight's a, a special night because uh, this band is here for the first time. Uh, and uh, I do want to introduce someone else who's going to give you a little bit of uh, an introduction to the band. Uh, and then we'll hear some music. So please welcome to the stage Jeff Ray. Hello, Bob Stop. Hello, Music Settlement people. Hello, Ooh. world. Yeah. I'm. Uh, I'm proud to say that uh, about five and a half years ago, I did a benefit here called the Parade of Guitars for the Music Settlement. And that was a really great event. Alan Grandy was here for Terrible Parade and a bunch of other bands. Carlos Jones played, um, and Alex Bevan played that night. And Joe Roland Porter, who's played the 10 by 3 that some of you may be familiar with, was at that event, and it was really, really cool. So anyway. Um, speaking of Fridays, Saturdays, and Sundays, I want to make one mention. For this Saturday night, there's going to be an awesome, and I mean awesome, show here tonight, or here on Saturday night. It's called Our Day Will Come, Northeast Ohio Women Who Rock. And it was put on by uh, Thomas Mulready from Vanity Crash. And it pays tribute to all of the female fronted bands, or many of the female fronted bands that came out of Northeast Ohio, from Tracy Chapman all the way on up to Chrissy Hine and the Pretenders. So that's this Saturday night, and hopefully you can get a lot of people here for that, because it is going to be an awesome show. Bridget Behind the Bar and her band Super Babes is going to be playing that night, along with a whole bunch of other people. So anyway, Mary Martin has been playing around. Cleveland doing jazz inflected blues since their debut in the late 70s and, uh, as the Ninth Street Tuna Band. And they got their name from hanging out at Captain Frank's at Ninth Street, for those of you who can remember that far back. Yeah. Unfortunately, Captain Frank's is gone. Anyway, um, they released their first album in 1983 that also featured Glenn Schwartz, Mr. Stress, and the horn section from the Numbers Band, which also featured Terry Hine. And that received high praise from Billboard and even made the charts. So I've been aware of the tuna band for a long time, but it wasn't until last year's Waterloo Arts Fest that I actually got to see them for the first time. And First thing I thought of was this band has to play the Bob Stop because this place is just phenomenal and this band really, really fits in here well. So I was surprised to learn that after all these years that they hadn't taken the stage before. So I helped them get this thing arranged and I'm very glad that uh, they are making their debut here tonight. So please give a warm welcome for the Bob Stop debut of Mary Martin and the Tuna Band.
I'd forgotten a lot of that stuff. <laughs> it's been a while, and uh, we we're so happy to be here tonight uh, with the air conditioning, <laughs> etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. We, um, the three of us, have been a band for a very long time in most configurations, well, about 45 years, if we figure it out. <laughs> And, and it may show, and it may not, I don't need to tell you this, but um, we've had one rehearsal, actually, so that's where the jazz thing comes in. Maybe. Anyway, uh, we are happy to be joined by friends of ours tonight. Miss Linda Thomas-Jones on the phone tonight. Etc. Now we're going to be doing, we're, I figure we never use a set list. Ever. We just kind of, uh, you know, it feels right, we'll do this. But I have tonight, so if it feels a little stiff, maybe that's why. <laughs> but here we go. A lot of the things you're going to hear are original. Um, and if you don't know, then just assume they are. So. <laughs> <laughs> Too bad for me. Yeah, 
then the thunder roars. The wind so strong, it blew out my doors. And who comes in on your nightmare? It's you. Well, I should have seen this coming. A too bad for me. I gotta say it one more time. Yes, well, I should have seen it coming. Situations come and go. 
baby never before have I felt so blue. But then I never had to get over losing you. Ah, but you don't know till you get there. Now you do. That's for sure. Down for the 
I seem to be always about running away or running to. And uh, we're gonna, this next song is actually is a different place. Uh, I, I at one point I was uh, yeah I, did. I was uh, stuck and thought, what am I gonna do with my life? Be a musician? Maybe I don't know. Uh, we all hit these little crossroads sometimes. Anyway, so I sat down and I decided that this was the right and proper solution. So I wrote this song about that. Joining us is Jimmy Powers. Thank you. 
Dennis Albert. Bert and I have played for, we've played 45 years or something. Bert has a, an amazing pedigree. If you, if you look up Bert on Wikipedia, you don't have a Wikipedia page. <laughs> Bert has played with everybody. And, 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 well, what? Quite a history, anyway. I'm, I'm, I'm proud that he's my friend and, and my buddy over here for all this time. And, and we played so many shows that we can't remember where we played. Oh, yeah, there was a club there, that's right. We played at the, in the, in the library. We played at the library, that's right. On Chester, yeah, yeah. Then we played with, <laughs> we played with Per Ubu in the middle of. Of, uh, of, uh, of, uh, of Prospect, yeah, 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 on a truck or whatever. You live long enough, you get all these stories, and then you're all set. You know? um, uh, so anyway, uh, but this is it, one thing that Bert does so well to me. I mean, he does, he's all over the place, but he's exemplifying this song. You can laugh if you want. Oh, absolutely. I don't know what I'm doing, but I'm having fun. I hope you are too. Well, I'll meet you halfway on the boulevard underneath the lamppost by the yellow car where the street is wet and shiny with the evening dew. espresso machine. <laughs> so we finished everything, it's a long story there. And uh, then um, as I was coming home on the shoreway, in fact, you know, thinking I'm dying, this little, this is, well, you know, my heart was going 300 you know, beats per minute. Uh, I anyway wrote the song, so it's, it's, it, it's, it's more of a I made it kind of thing instead of a are we cute thing. Yeah. 
Yeah. 
most of these songs are uh, from our new release, which are for sale over there. For those of you who still uh, enjoy CDs or have glasses big enough to read the small print now that you don't have LPs, <laughs> either way, thank you for enjoying this. Um, well, let's see what we're going to do. Let's do the, the one nobody likes, indeed. <laughs> <laughs> That's Kurt's favorite. Yeah. It was that or diversity, but here we go. Okay. <laughs> Tell me how I wear a 
It's a marvelous night for a moon dance With the stars up above in your eyes A fantabulous night to make romance Oh, out there under the skies I said that the leaves on the trees are falling To the sound of the breezes that blows And I'm trying my best and I'm trying so hard, oh yeah Every time